It's called the Through the Valley Project, and your opinion matters. It is why the public is invited to sound off about noise barriers on northbound I-75. Nine on your side, traffic reporter Adam Marshall spoke with residents who will be affected, and he explains what you need to know. The open house style event is actually happening right now through 7 this evening here at the Lachlan High School. You're invited to come on out, learn more about the proposed noise barriers on northbound I-75, and of course, give your opinion to ODOT officials. Daniel Foley has lived right next to northbound I-75 for nearly 50 years. He says the meeting is a great idea. However, he's unsure about the noise barriers. They don't seem to be doing so good with the holes in the road. Uh, how can they find a sound barrier? It's a, kind of a funny thing, you know, I don't know. Exhibits like this map will be on hand this evening to help residents see exactly where the noise barriers would go. Officials are looking into the barriers on northern I-75 from around Galbraith Road to the northern end of the Lachlan split. After five decades, Foley now just jokes about the noise. You live just feet from the interstate, and if I may say so, it seems pretty loud here. Yeah, but if I may say so, I wear a hoodie. <laughs> Officials hope to see many residents funnel into Lachlan High School's gym to learn all the details. But if you can't make the meeting, that's okay. You can always just go to WCPO.com, where we have a breakdown of the entire project. Adam Marshall, 9 on your side, Lachlan. A teen